so I stopped being lazy and finally went out to explore on New Year's. This is how it went down. You must be wondering how I got here. Let me show you what happened. Every New Year is the same thing. Sitting at home or at friend's house. But this time, I decided to do it differently. Luckily, my friend asked me if I wanted to join him for camping at Bandadara on New Year's Eve. And I decided to join him for a change. So the journey began by the train to Kasara. We made a small stop at a dhaba for some lunch. Welcome to And then the road trip started. The sun was setting down and we almost reached our destination. And then we were finally there. After reaching the campsite, we were briefed about everything. We started setting up the tents. And the camp started. Even though it was so cold, but that couldn't stop me from taking a wonderful experience back home. Meeting new people. So much better than tenting under one plus six. One plus six. I made new friends. I celebrated the new year like never before. And the countdown began. Finally, it was 2019. We all had a lot of fun. Took some pictures, spent the cold night in the tents, and waited for the morning. Okay, so it's currently morning. I can't feel my hands. It's so cold. I'm literally shivering right now. So it's the first day of 2019, and it's freaking cold. I mean, what better can it be than waking up to this? I always wanted to see the first sunrise of the year. I don't know why. I just wanted to see it. And guess what I saw?
time to leave the campsite and continue the journey. We packed our things and went back to the cars for the next destination, Sandan Valley. The trip was finally over. Now it was time to go back. A long way. The journey may have been a little uncomfortable and long, but at the end, it was a wonderful experience. Meeting new people, exploring new places, and most importantly, having fun. It was all worth it. So that's been it. I hope you enjoyed this video. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.